the Halton Hills Public Library is ready to take your letters to Santa. With the COVID-19 pandemic forcing the library to modify their usual holiday programming, Children's Services Librarian Lisa Hunsiger says their Letters to Santa initiative is the least they can do to maintain a connection to the jolly old man. Well, Santa is one of our favorite people, and in fact, usually we have Mrs. Claus come to the library around this time of the year to do story time for us. Obviously, we're not doing that this year in the library, so it was really important that we figured out some something else that we could do to work with one of our favorite people. We have this fabulous mailbox that was donated by a local business, and so we've put together these great kits that include um, a letter template, a pencil, an envelope, and a sweet treat that kids can nibble on while they're writing their letters. Letters to Santa does more than just get your letters to the North Pole. Hunsiger says it's a great learning activity as well. Early literacy is really important to us, so early literacy is what kids know about reading before they actually start to read. And printing, letter recognition, uh, reading the letters that you're writing to Santa, doing all of those, um, figuring out what letters go with what, what you're spelling, that's all really important. So this kit, even though it's going to be fun to do, because you know, once the kids write their letter, they can come back to the library and pop it into the mailbox, but they're also learning too. Kids can drop by at the library during business hours to pick up their kits. Hunsiger says they are hoping lots of children will participate. You know, it's been a tough year for families. It's been a hard year. And it's still hard, and it's going to keep getting hard. So we just really wanted to do something that would bring some joy to our HHPL families. And I've got some extra good news. The Halton Hills Public Library just doesn't have this drop-off here in Georgetown. For you kids over in Acton, you can head on over to your library there and drop a letter off to Santa as well. And I do want to let you know that you have until December 10th to drop off your letters to Santa if you want to get a reply. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Melissa Candelaria.